Hello, this is a guide to add multiple animations to your K-Type mechanical keyboard. This guide assumes that you have DFU-Util installed, the most recent configurator, and that you've properly set up your drivers with Zadig. If you haven't taken these steps, you should watch one of our other videos on how to flash your K-Type from scratch. Okay, let's begin. First, let's launch the configurator. I have a K-Type plugged in, and it's currently in flash mode, just to make this process a little faster. That's why it says ready to flash up here. Uh, what we're going to do is we are going to add a simple animation to the F1 key, but only in layer one, so that you have to press function F1 to start it. And we are going to set a different animation to start if you press function F2. Um, this is a mildly complex uh, set of instructions, so let's begin, and you can follow along. We'll start by going to the Visuals tab. You notice this gear we're on Manage Visualizations. Uh, Rainbow Wave is the stock animation that comes with all the K-types, and it's set to Auto Start. What we're going to do is we're going to add a pre-built animation that comes with the configurator. This one is Miami Wave, which is a very nice pink and blue uh, animation that's visually very distinct from the Rainbow Wave. So we're just going to add this animation. Okay. Uh, if we click on this gear, you'll notice that we now have Rainbow Wave and Miami Wave, and we're ready to bind these visuals to a key. So what we're going to do is you'll notice this is the base layer. This is where you just normally are typing. And layer one is if you hit F1. There are different function layers you can bind things to, but for right now, we just have F1. Uh, we are going to bind a change command to the F1 key on layer one such that it stops the rainbow wave that is set to auto start just plays when you plug your k-type in and begin the miami wave okay so here's how we're going to do that first we set rainbow wave to stop and we're going to hit the plus sign and then we're going to set miami wave to start and hit the plus sign okay then what we're going to do is because we don't want to actually press F1 and have F1 be sent to the computer when we hit this. We only want it to change the animation. We're going to bind the none command to F1 when it's on layer one. So that way, if F1 does something on your computer, uh, it just won't issue that, that command. So let's go to the second one, F2. And we're going to do the inverse of what we've done before, which is we're going to have Miami wave stop, and we're going to have the rainbow wave start. So, and, and we'll hit the plus sign. Make sure you do that so that both of these are added. Um, the, and we'll do the same thing that we've done with the F1 key, which is make it do none, so that you don't accidentally press F2 when you hit function F2 to issue this command. Uh, what we've done now is we've set, and you can see it, that Miami wave starts, or rainbow wave will stop if it's going. We hit F1, and if we hit F2, Miami wave will stop if it's going, and rainbow wave will begin. So what we'll do now is we're just going to download this, and we are going to flash it. And it looks like we're pretty good. And you can't see this, but I'm going to hit function F1. And it looks like we have Miami, and I'm going to hit function F2, and it switches to the rainbow wave. So this is the quick and dirty guide to uh, adding multiple animations to your K-type. I hope this makes it simple for you. Thank you so much. Bye. If you have any questions, by the way, one last thing, uh, we do have a Discord channel where you can ask anything that you want and we will do our best to help you out. Uh, there's a link in the video description here.
And we'd be happy to take a look at whatever your situation is and see if either ourselves at Input Club or a member of the community who knows a little bit more about uh, programming custom keyboards than you do is able to figure out what's going on and point you in the right direction. So check the link in, our, in the YouTube description uh, to check out our Discord channel. Bye.